today we are back with another custom made legendary weapon. This one has been inspired by the Pokemon Ghastly. Stay tuned to find out how you can get your hands on this amazing creation. How's it going guys, my name is DPJ and today I bring you another BR3 video. If you do enjoy it, leaving a like really helps out and subscribe if you do want to see more. Also before we go any further, for all your gaming needs, no matter the platform you play it on, at amazing prices and incredible weekly deals, check out G2A, linked within the video description. So I have already covered the amazing Charizard inspired Firestorm, the incredible Pikachu inspired Mutant and today we check out another handcrafted legendary by the man himself, Evil X Jugs, who creates in my opinion the best well balanced legendaries you will see but do nothing but make the game even more fun to play. His channel can be found linked within the video description if you do want to check him out and see what he does. So today's weapon was inspired by Ghastly, the ghost Pokemon, who evolves into Hunter and then on into Gengar. The weapon which has been rebuilt from the ground up is nothing other than the Soul Render, which makes sense as it shoots ghosts, it shoots skulls, hence the inspiration to Ghastly. Now the Soul Render as standard is a very unique weapon, like I said it shoots out those tracking skulls, a lot like what we see with the bloody Harvest Gas Cool Grenade, and it fires out these ghosts at random I do believe upon you just shooting at enemies. Now this weapon as standard did receive a slight nerf just upon release, which in my opinion took away from the original I got to use before the release, which is a shame. So I was definitely looking forward to seeing and using this custom built version, and people I can tell you this thing is utterly incredible. So the Ghastly Soul Render is an amazingly fun weapon to use, its main element is Cryo, but upon it hitting that enemy it deals all types of elemental damage, shock, cryo, radiation and corrosive. Its damage has been slightly scaled too to make it a little more powerful and its magazine size has been adjusted accordingly to make this a true contender when playing. Now the thing I love about this handcrafted weapon is the fact it ain't OP. Like many of other Evil X Jugs weapons, they fit many aspects of the game balance wise to not make the game quickly become boring. Yes it does great damage and it deals all elemental types, but it doesn't make you invincible and in most cases you have to be smart with that ammo while using this thing because it burns through that ammo quite quickly and you can become easily carried away with this thing because it is that good. So yes, if you get your hands on this, use it with caution but have fun at the same time. But in saying that, it's easily right now and I know it's modded, but for me it's the most fun I've had with an assault rifle in a long time playing this game. Now I know many many people are not into modded weapons, they want to use original standard weapons that can drop in game, which I completely understand. I mean I don't like using modded weapons which take away from the game, things that are just stupid OP which one shot everything. I mean you can't imagine the amount of incent and they're just utterly ridiculous. But weapons like this, and I said this a while back when I uploaded a video on the first modded weapon to make its way into console, I said I can get behind a feature in place where we can create our own weapons, obviously if there's limits in place. Yeah there are no limits with modded weapons and what you can do on PC and transfer them to consoles, but if someone takes their time out to make a weapon not OP but fun to use, which is what Evil X Drugs does, then I have no problem using, playing with them and even showcasing them. And that's what I bring you today, this amazing ghastly soul render assault rifle. So how do you get your hands on it? Well it is quite simple, just join my discord link within the video description where we'll be doing an open loot lobby pretty soon. Now many of my community over on my discord do have the previous Pokemon themed items too, so if you missed out there, ask within my discord and someone will help you out no matter the platform you play on. But yeah guys this has been the showcase of this amazing ghastly Pokemon themed soul render and you now know how to get your hands on it. And on that note guys, we have come to the end of the video. If you guys enjoyed it, leaving a like really helps out. If you're new around here and want to see more Borderlands, be sure to subscribe. And if you never want to miss a video I upload, you can turn notifications on by hitting that bell button. But guys, thanks as always for stopping by. Hopefully you enjoyed the video and hopefully I will see you on that next one.
Dear. 